And we have new images uh, this morning that show some of the worst hit areas in Japan, both before and then after the quake. The differences are very stark, and these pictures really show us the scope of the devastation. Josh Lebs has that for us. Josh? Yeah, you know, Randy, a lot of people have been waiting for these pictures to start coming out, and I have brand new ones for you all this morning. Let's do this first before my screen. I want to go to this video, uh, which is an example of the bird's eye view kind of thing. Uh, this is from NHK. Here's an example of Sendai before and then after. So we're seeing this kind of video from above, and it's very stark there. Now, take a look here. I'm about to show you more than a dozen sites that were affected. We're going to zoom in on the screen here. This came to me from Google, and this is a before image from one place inside Sendai. I'm going to hit play here and let it go a little bit, and you're going to see town after town, village after village, areas that are just completely shattered. Look at that, from green to this dark brown where homes have been destroyed, where livelihoods have been destroyed, where large areas of grass are just gone. And this is right here is Yuriyagi in Notori. Um, dozens and dozens of pictures like this are coming out. And what you can tell in all these pictures is that these are places where people live. These are places where there were villages and communities. Uh, in some places, cities, very active cities. This is the Sendai Airport area right here. I mean, look at that. Look at these satellite pictures. It's just knocking out entire areas. And it's just an onslaught. It just keeps coming. These are the kinds of things that we knew would come uh, within a couple of days after this disaster. And what happened here is Google got together with their satellite partners, which is uh, Digital Eye and uh, GeoGlobe. And they just looked at pictures from previous years and they put it together uh, with some of the latest pictures there. One other video, too, we can go to now, another one from NHK, which shows another area that's, being, that's been uh, uh, just shattered by this. This is uh, Rikuzenta Kata. Uh, again, before and after. This is the kinds of videos that you get when you're just high enough, even without the satellites able to see uh, what's going on there. One more interactive I want to show you here. Let's zoom way in here. We might need to drop the banner, but let's get the shot. I want everyone to see this. You can control this before and after here. This right here is Sendai. This is on CNN.com. Watch what happens. I'm going to slide it myself. And as we go across, the shots match so you can physically see how these areas have changed. And it's not just Sendai that we're seeing. Here is the uh, Fukushima power plant area. This is the before. And I'm going to move us over to the after, and you can see the change happening along the way. I've taken all these links right here, and I've posted them for you online so you can see them yourself. Uh, these are my pages. I'm at Facebook and Twitter at Josh Lev, CNN. We have a lot more where this came from, and this is just the beginning. More and more pictures like this will be coming through. And it's the same idea, uh, Randy, as, as what you and Andrew were talking about and what I've been reporting on, which is that this is the most documented disaster mm -hmm. ever. Inside, the people taking YouTube videos on the inside, and also, because of the new satellite technologies we have, we've never had such detail before on any natural disaster in history. There's a lot that people will be learning from this that might help uh, some recovery in the coming weeks. And, and, and even with all the damage, the fact that they can still get those pictures out and the video out is, is remarkable. Yeah, because what happens going down here, I mean, the Earth might change on its axis, but the satellites are still working just fine up in the sky, and that's exactly. what's getting the pictures here.